Hey everybody, this is Dan for GameD on Cars. Now, I hope you're coming to this video from my previous video, which is a walk around of this. This is a 2017 uh, Mazda Miata RF. Uh, it's got a 2 liter 4 cylinder engine, 155 horsepower, 138 foot pounds of torque. Now, in this video, we're going to take it for a drive. So, here we go. The best part of this car is that it has a 6 speed manual. So, let's start her up. All right, here we go. All right, so we are in the Miata RF. This is a 2017 with a six-speed manual. Now, I have this is probably the smallest car I have ever driven, and it, you could park this thing anywhere. So, the clutch feels so nice. The shifter is very smooth. Now, the main question that I have for this car is that is it too do i fit now me being a guy that's six feet tall um by the way i had the top up we're gonna put it down when we get out on the road but i just want to experience this car as a convertible so i fit but i have whoa i have the seat completely back the whole way i have the seat reclined the whole way man this shifter is so nice so i fit but i think somebody that was a little bit bigger than me would not fit so I have borrowed this car from click Lewis Chevrolet Buick in Palmyra Pennsylvania and this car is for sale for $19,700 which is not a lot of money for a small little 2c Roadster so go check out their website I will put it right here yeah if you were somebody who was trying to learn how to drive stick this would be a perfect car to learn how to drive it the clutch feels nice nice and smooth um, it, when I, it doesn't lean back at all when I got off the brake, but man, this is sweet. Now the advantage to the fixed roof, now this car is called an RF, which stands for Retractable Fastback, but it should be FR, stand for Fixed Roof. You could technically drive this car year round, you know, you have a folding hard top that, you know, you wouldn't have to worry about having a cloth top being out into the elements, you know, depending on where you live. The shifter is so smooth. I, I, I definitely miss driving a stick car because it's been a long time. Now, the last stick car that I drove was a Honda S2000, which was you know an absolute joy to drive. So I can sort of compare this car to that car. Um, it sounds pretty good for a two liter. Yeah, not bad at all. Yeah, this car has just always been a legendary Japanese roadster. And with the addition of this, the RF, you know, the fixed hardtop, the folding hardtop um, it just gives it another sort of element of you know practicality now the visibility is pretty good um, I can see it feels like the car behind me is like 10 feet away just because it's it's right back there you can see everything pretty good with the mirrors I mean the visibility is good <laughs> it sounds really good for a 2 liter um, me being a Mazda owner my car is a different engine than this uh, it's a two and a half liter but this car this engine sounds way better. And now, being 155 horsepower, um, once I get done with this, I'm gonna decide if I think it needs more power. But as of right now, I don't think so. And the 2019 model got a little bit of a power bump up from 155 that this car has up to 181. So that sort of even sweetens the pot even more. Um, the S2000 I drove had 240 horsepower out of a two liter four cylinder so this car is is almost a hundred horsepower less than an s2000 but I don't I don't miss it sure sure this car would not rev as much as that s2000 because that car was just incredible but this this feels you know like it could be just as fun with just down a little bit on power driving or even like a weekend car that you can go on back roads like I'm doing right now this would be more than adequate so if I'm in fifth gear if I just drop down to fourth gear <laughs> it's definitely gonna work you know you 
you got to get it up there in the rev range a little bit just to feel the power. And plus, you got to downshift a lot. That was fifth into fourth. Yeah, this is fun. This is fun. You know, this this car is is sort of not on a bigger scheme, but it's sort of like. I think of like a Porsche 911. That thing has been around for 50 years and they've had so many years to develop it. This car has been around for like 30 years. They've had so much time to perfect it and hone it and it, it definitely shows. I mean, this is a blast. This is a blast to drive. somebody drive this and they had to guess how much power it was no way they'd say 155 all right just to get a little idea what it's like to drive this I'm gonna do a little bit of a POV view but we're gonna put the top down too you just press on that button and it'll tell you how complete you are all right so here we go Nobody is around me. It is a beautiful day here in Palmyra, Pennsylvania. I'm going to keep the windows up. All right. The shifter is so nice. I've got unlimited headroom. It is a beautiful day here. All right, let's just give her the beans just a little bit. And I'm gonna wait because there is somebody coming. All right, here we go. <laughs> that was in third gear. And the car is yelling at me to stay in my line. <laughs> you know, the wind noise is not too bad. Now, I have my mouth right over my microphone, so I hope you can hear me. The wind noise is not that bad with the door, with the windows up. If you're a car guy, this is what it's all about. A back road and a manual shifter in an awesome car. This is this is this is so much fun. Yeah, this is what it's about. Yep, the car is beeping at me. Now, just to take it a little bit easy. Yeah, I'm comfortable. This car is fast, fast enough. The shifter is so sweet to drive. Yeah, so I'm in fourth gear. We're gonna go into third. little go of the Miata RF. <laughs> yes! This is awesome. This is quite a little car. 
All right, one last little straight. <laughs> yep. This is awesome. Just, it's just as fun to drive as the S2000. That car was a little bit quicker, but it, it, the, the folding top adds to the experience. It's just, what, what more can you say in that it's a fun little roadster to drive? All right, so just got back to the dealer here. Now, this car is so much fun. Um, for under $20,000, this car is on sale for nineteen seven. I really think the only other car that could sort of be as fun is like an S2000. I mean, you know, 2C roadsters are like a dying breed anymore, but this car has been around forever. And it is it is just an absolute blast to drive. You know, this is one of my one of the most pure you know driving experiences I've had. I haven't driven a stick in a while, so that added to the extra fun. Plus, I've got the top down, and I've got a million miles of headroom. So, go buy this car if you are around. Uh, Click Lewis Chevy Buick here in Palmyra, Pennsylvania. Come come in, see my buddy Zach. Give this thing a shot. This could be an awesome car as like a little weekend toy or even with the folding hardtop you can drive it year round so this is an amazing car I love it you know it makes me happy that I own a Mazda to know that they can do things like this with a little Roadster um, I imagine that the 2019 with a little bit of a power bump would be so much fun to drive too so um, thanks for watching leave me a comment below let me know what you think of this car um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button don't forget to follow me on Instagram to see the cars that I drive before it gets posted to YouTube now I'm gonna be coming back here a lot because they have a lot of used cars here that are just you know quality cars so don't forget to check out click Lewis Chevy Buick at clicklewiscars.com and I will see you in the next one see ya